Hello. Um, I guess this is going to be kind of like three parts. I'm going to, um, I'll just put it in the title. <laughs> so you'll see that by now. Um, today's just going to be a vlog day. Tomorrow I'm going to start with Dad's footage of the polka party. So get ready for polka palooza, people. But first I want to start by thanking all the people, day before yesterday, who commented on a video. The people who don't, who rarely comment. It was awesome. It made me smile to see comments from, especially from some people who I haven't seen comments in from from a while. So, um, I want to say hi to one. Hi, Rose. Um, I'll be PMing you back sometime in the next few days, so. I've got glitter everywhere. Oh, I stuck with it, people. Um, so thank you, thank you, thank you. And then yesterday also, uh, okay, <laughs> I guess it's going to be kind of a four-parter. <laughs> I was I was doing some commenting back on my on that video, and um, I um, went to go. I stopped. I think the last comment I made before I started working on stuff was Beth's. I said I'm going to go do the restore, so I got out of YouTube, and I'm I'm going to set the restore. And it goes through the process or whatever, and it tells me I have to shut off Norton, so I do restore again. So while I'm waiting all that happen, the house is open, beautiful day, Dad's out mowing, and I hear, Neely! And I'm like, oh. Oh, no. Yeah, the aunt stopped by. She come in, what are you doing? I'm like, ah, uh, my computer's kind of having a problem. Oh, can we look up this? I'm like, Aunt Jenny right now? not the best time to ask me to look stuff up on my computer because it's doing stuff. So, she goes outside. Dad's way in the back and um, doesn't see her. He did, but he just pretended like he didn't. I found out later. And so, she she sits in the living room. She goes, come out here. My stress level at that point was not the best. So, I'm like, okay. I go out and I sit in the kitchen. She comes and sits in the kitchen with me. And it's always the same. She looks around to see what she can have. And um, on the table there's these two little containers, sealed containers, that I had bought at the um, flea market. There were two, like, pecan rolls, and there were the last, like, cinnamon roll. And for the last two that she had, she'd save them for me because I asked her earlier in the day if she would put two aside for me. And, um... So I got them special for Dad and I, and she opened them up. She goes, oh, can I have this? I'm like, no. What? I'm like, those were the last two of the day. I got one for Dad and one for me, and that's our breakfast tomorrow morning. Oh, I said, you can have a pretzel. Here's a soft pretzel. So he did that up for her. She put mustard on it. She sat there and talked. <clears throat> for a person who is always bumming money for gas and stuff, she, uh... I was on her way home from New Buffalo, which for her is about a 30 to 40 minute drive. She drove there to see somebody who apparently was not around. So didn't you call her? Well, Jack has her phone, which is our ex, it's, I don't know, it's an ex family member, but still we know him. <clears throat> Since he divorced my cousin, but everybody's still friends. And he's dating this person. And um, she went over there, and the address she had, we'll say it was 207. There was a house at 209 and a house at 205, but where 207 was supposed to be, no house. So she said, Stacy, I went up and down that road looking for that house, and it wasn't there. I'm like, oh. And if it was any normal person, they probably were working during the day if Jenny got the house number wrong. Or if somebody gave her the wrong house number on purpose. She's like, if somebody did that on purpose, that is not funny. So, she hung out with me for a few, and then Dad came in with a mower, and she went out and talked with him for a bit, and um, then she left. Okay, back to the computer. I called. The restore did not work. So I called um, Intuit, which is the people who do QuickBooks, and um talked to a really nice Indian lady because I said 
are you in India? She goes, yes, our call center is in India. And um, while it was doing something, we were talking about Indian food. I said, I really like Indian food. She goes, you do? Like, she was shocked. I'm like, yeah. But um, she was awesome. She, um, I knew we were going to have to upgrade. And I said, I want to upgrade our software because I know I'm going to do that anyway. So I'm on the phone with you. Let's do it anyway. So we got the 2013 Pro version of QuickBooks. And um, so she, I let her do it remotely. She did it all for me. I just sat here and watched my computer screen. And uh, so she tried to open that file up in the new version, and it still was saying the same exact error message. So she's like, what I'm going to do is download this off your computer and um, fix it. And she said, I'll call you back a little later. And um, I'm like, okay. So like 6.30 last night, the phone rang. And I saw it was her, so I, I picked it up. And she's like, I have your file fixed. Are you able to go to the computer and um, we can get you up and running? And I said, um, sure. I was talking to my cousin Ronnie at the time. He was here. I'm like, you go do what you got to do. I got to get this fixed. So um, we were, she remoted my computer again, and um, it's all working. All my files are there. Everything is going good. It looks a lot different than the, the QuickBooks 2010 um, Simple Start version because that was really the, the easy man's version. I have to learn a lot. There's a lot more options on this one. So I figured out, you know, where the invoicing was. I, I uh, posted some payments to it last night. I checked the register to make sure it was everything looks pretty good. So I was happy with that. After that was up and running, the stress just went. Whoosh. Oh yeah. Um, and then yesterday, this came in the mail. Wow, oh, this is going to be the end section of my blog. The package. This is from Joan, who loves Disney on Facebook. She's awesome. Um, she's also a friend of Jack and Jared. And um, I've only cut open the end. I do not know what's in there, because my dad keeps saying, what's in it? I'm like, I haven't looked yet. So, um, we will look right now. It's a Halloween package. Oh, Heidi got a Halloween toy. This says, I squeak right on his forehead. Oh, she'll like that. Thank you, Joan. And ooh, that's a little two little tiny kitty cats. Are these? I think these might be erasers. You, ooh, pow! They're tiny too. I don't want to lose them. Haha! I'm gonna cough. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, she sent me some box tops for my aunt. Thank you so much. Those are always greatly appreciated. And. A pencil and a little notepad and a button that says the organic grape explorations. I love me some grape. And the pad is from Nevada State Bank. And the pen, the pencil is two. Uh oh, Kitty's gonna be happy. Oops, more. Uh oh, there's a whole buttload of kitties in here. Hang on. You gotta save them all. You don't want any of the family to get lost. Let's put you up here. I hope I didn't show any addresses doing that. Because if I did, I'm sorry. It would mainly be mine, you would see, I think. Yeah, because Jones is way too little. Hang on. I know I'm a hot mess, huh? Oh, pumpkins, too. So there's a whole bunch of these little guys. The whole family. I'm going to put them right in the Ziploc bag with a pencil, so I don't lose The Mari racers, I'm assuming. Sometimes you know, assuming you can make an ass out of it. Um, Kitty got some treats. She's going to love them. She got salmon flavored and chicken flavored and tuna shrimp and salmon flavored and chicken catnip and cheddar flavored. Oh, he's doing the disco. He's like, oh yeah. Okay. And here is a Halloween package. Oh, I think the kitty fell out of that because his butt is broken open. I think that's what happened. Let's see what's in here. First we got a little frisbee. 
And we got some stickers. Stickers. And. Oh, 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 oh a bat. I bet you he glows in the dark. Um, a little pad of paper with a, a witch on it. Oh, all kinds of really goodies in here. Quality finish. Oh, yep, I see more of those in here. Some more of them. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. There's some more of the, um, the crayons. A fruit roll up. Another fruit roll up. A couple eyeballs. Hello. Um, oh, there's so many little things in here. Um, a skeleton. Another bat. Another bat. Another bat. I got a bat family. Bat family. A couple little yo-yos, but how do you get the string? Where's the string in the yo-yo? I'll figure that out. A puzzle. I like these little puzzles. I will be doing that. Some more crayons. A little cube. A ruby cube thing. <gasps> oh, yeah. Fangs. I got purple fangs. And I have black ones and green ones and uh, orange ones. <laughs> What's this thing? A stamper with a witch's head on it. Oh, the crayons go with these little books. Of things, fun game books. I have stuff to do at my desk now, and other. There's so many things, people. It's just hard. More skeletons, and a card that is stickerified. Look at the stickers. Let's see what the card looks like. You're probably all bored of my vlog by now. <laughs> it's exciting. It's like being a little kid. <gasps> Another Wiener dog card. Look at him. He's so cute. <laughs> Happy Halloween. -er. For me, Dad, Heidi, and Kitty. From Joan, Don, Daisy, Mickey, Red, Roger, Dale, Emma, and Belle. The white bats glow in the dark. Yeah, she put a little note in here <laughs> telling me that. Thank you so much, Joan. Now my desk is a, a Halloween mess. Oh, it's so fun. But now we're going to go out into the world. We're going to go do a little shopping. We're going to go have a little lunch because it is almost 11 o'clock. And I know we got to buy milk. I need to put body wash on my list. i got to get my phone because my body wash is gone. I dig out one from the cupboard. It was Juniper Berry. I don't like it as well as I like my oil of Olay orchid. I think it's orchid. So I get some of that. I might get some ribs and try to do crock pot barbecue ribs. I've never done it before, but it just crossed my mind last night, and I'm like, I kind of want to do it. Can't be hard. Just put them in there with some sauce and let them cook all day, right? All right, I'm rolling. Bye.